Greetings everybody, this is Shadowstar here, or Marksman72 for my PlayStation ID, and welcome to the next video for my Let's Play series for Marvel Spider-Man, the remastered version. And just in case anybody wants to check out the other videos from my Let's Play series for this game, I will leave the playlist links in the video description down below. Okay, before I give everybody a recap, I'm just going to quickly beat up these guys. Because shooting at me while I'm swinging through the city, not cool. Oh yeah, and I really need to refill my gadgets as well. Or oh, what I wouldn't give for the resupply ability right now. Oh, I missed the oh, I missed the timing. Damn it. Yeah. Yeah. Thanks, MJ. I gotta process some stuff, I think. Call me any Bit of a tough dilemma. That question. Okay, so no change in the Daily Bugle headlines. Okay, then, so. Before I was rudely interrupted by those jackasses who shot at me. For a quick recap for the previous video, just in case anybody has missed it. In the previous video, travel to the reservoir to try and stop Scorpion's attempt of uh, poisoning the water supply. Oh, come on, not... They cannot take a fucking hint. But it ended up being an am hallucinate... Uh, let me try that again. A hallucinogenic ambush where Scorpion injected the webhead with a new kind of poison. Where the hallu hallucinations he encountered actually turned out almost uh, real, which tr tried to kill him, and some of these hallucinations included uh, giant scorpion tails, a, hu uh, a very large river of acid, and of course there was also the, hallu the stage conversions of Otto Octavius, where he, where he was not a villain, and then the second stage where he was in the process of being converted and then stage three fully converted villain and of course if anybody hasn't put it together yet yes i am wearing the no way home hybrid suit okay also i should mention that uh oh my god these guys are getting on my nerves uh fun to beat up anyway Uh, where was I? Oh yeah, uh, just a quick heads up for anybody who does notice this. If I do hesitate or stutter with any of my sentences, excuse me, being an autistic individual, talk is not one of my strongest points, but I do try anyway. And if I do stay silent during certain cutscenes and or gameplay sections, for the cutscenes, it's because I want to give everybody a chance to hear what is going on during the cutscene. And for the gameplay section, it's because I want to try and stay focused. And try not to die. I mean, really. These Sable agents are getting on my nerves. Can I get the timing right? Yes, I can. It's an... And if anybody's wondering what I mean by that, it's because of a skill upgrade that I purchased earlier in the game. Whenever I perform a finishing move, if I get the timing right, I can actually perform a second finishing move, maneuver on another enemy that I encounter. So instead of just doing on one and relying on the... And relying on the fo focus bars to refill. Like so. You get the timing right, you can perform a, you can perform a second finishing maneuver. Yeah, so that takes care of them. Onward to the feast center. Trying to check in on May, and hopefully she hasn't uh, run herself into the ground just yet. So yeah, at the feast center. Until Miles gets back, the best thing we can do is keep everyone fed. Oh, Peter, it is so good to see you. How are you? Healthy? I'm good. How are you holding up, May? Good, but busy. Oh, let me go. <laughs> oh. oh, there. <coughs> oh, 
I'm okay. Didn't you tell me something once about accepting that I'm human just like everyone else? You and Ben. <coughs> Masters at turning my own words against me. I am fine, Peter. Just a little rundown. Where's Miles? Could he help out? Oh, he is. He's off picking up medical supplies from the relief center. It's amazing how quickly we go through antibiotics. Okay. You stay off your feet for a bit. I'll organize the unloading and check in with Miles. Deal? Deal. Give me a chance to nurse my wounded Parker pride. On Miles' answer. Don't make me worry about you and me. Quiet, quiet. So much for a milk run. How did a bunch of convicts even do this? Looks like an exploding bulldozer went through here. I can't turn back. Beast needs those antibiotics. You hear the sound Are you for real, Miles? You've gone in the middle of a hotspot to find antibiotics. I mean, seriously, couldn't you have looked somewhere else? Oh, teenagers, they really give me a headache. Well, no turning back now, he's made up his mind. And of course, if anybody is new to the channel and you do like what you see, feel free to hit the thumbs up icon down below, along with leaving a comment. I always look forward to hearing what everybody thinks of the current video. And if you want to be notified for future content, hit the subscribe button down below, along with the bell to receive notifications for when new content has been released onto the channel. Maybe this will be easy. Any way to distract the idiots? Ooh, a crashed drone. Yeah, I think. Yeah, between the power, the power junction and the drone, the drone is the safer option. Got move. More supplies over there. Okay, he's turning his back. Time to move. Yep, yeah, this is the problem. Even though there is a prisoner patrolling, this is definitely the safer route. Saves me possibly getting spotted. Okay, just stay behind him. Take it easy. And once he's turned his back, make a move. Digging through it. Another supply tent. A couple trauma kits. No antibiotics. They gotta be somewhere. Oh boy. Trying to delve deeper in, into the hot spot. Gotta avoid that sniper. Oh crap. Okay, so that's the prisoner out the way, but now. Oh! Thought that prisoner was gonna hear the glass then. Let it let that be the one. Come on. There's gotta be some antibiotics there. Yes! There's some antibiotics. Moxicillin. Perfect. There's a very large man. I found the exploding bulldozer. Supply roots and schedules. Now! Just as out! Gentlemen, I apologize. My associate is. inelegant. He doesn't understand the fine art of persuasion. Stop! <gasps> Did not need to see that. Oh, crap. So, Rhino and Scorpion. At this hot spot, now I've got to be extra careful. Especially with the big guy. Need to get him looking the other way. Come. Oh, the hacking app's in range. Sorry, my nose was a bit itchy there. 
Oh, try that again. Oh, come on. It does spot me. Come on. Honestly, this version of Rhino is actually my favorite one. Out of the other uh, versions that have been presented over the years, this is definitely my favorite by a long way. I gotta get out this way. Gotta find a way out before you make uh, another round. Last thing I want to be is be spotted by Rhino. So he's looking the other way. Come on. Okay, gotta move. Oh, I think I've overdone it. Crap. I spotted. I'll try this again. Ooh. Hopefully I don't get spotted, because Rhino is not happy right now. Wait for it. I do not need this. Go. <laughs> of course, I'm surprised you didn't hear that. Up through the container. Uh-oh, he's getting closer. Oh, Jesus. That was close. Yeah, it's time for you to leave. I don't even know why you even went in there uh, looking for antibiotics. Oh, great. That container. That's my exit. There's nothing. That's the only thing in range. No, if I go that way, he'll probably see me. Oh, the forklift it is. Okay, gotta move. Okay, gotta run. Oh, that... Cut that close again. Okay, big guy. Clear me in an exit. Thank you. Wait until he makes his move. Okay, time to make... Time to run for it. Time to run for it and get out of here. Oh boy. Uh, don't just sit there, Miles. Move. Saying anything in a second. <laughs> oh! Whoa. You want a taste? Nah, I'm good, kid. You want a taste? 
Gotta work on my fight banner. Miles? Hey, I've been trying to reach you. You okay? Hey, so, uh, don't freak out, but, um, I gotta fill you in on some stuff. Okay then, so with Miles' close encounter work, Miles. completed, Stick time to rejoin the webhead the and go chase after way. Rhino and Scorpion to take them here? down for Hell good. Great. Thanks, Miles. Besides, Yuri, still owe Scorpion some field. payback for, us, for injecting me with that poison. Like got the target. Who the? Oh, you son of a bitch. You are going to get a beating now. I do not appreciate being shot at whilst I am web swinging through the city. Thank you very much. I'll probably encounter some more groups like that along the way. So let's get going. More and more Question for everybody. Name your favorite versions of the webhead that you've seen across the years. Leave them leave your answers down in the comment section below. Takes care of those two sable jerks. Sad part is, okay then. Hour, Time to continue on. And to start things off, my three favorite versions of the webhead have to be. Kane Parker's Scarlet Spider, the Superior Spider-Man from Earth 616, and my top spot has to be this version of Spider-Man from Earth 1048. I don't know why they just don't take the hint. Okay then, so with that group of Sable agents beaten up, time to continue the journey to the Harlem Center to deal with Rhino. Don't know why he can't just take up a job as a demolition worker. He'd be world, fa world famous by now. Oh boy, got a missile incoming. Gotta move, gotta move. Missile averted. Thankfully. Sorry, I had to think of the words then. Okay, I'm getting closer. Now, I don't really don't have time to mess around with these bunch of jackasses who try to pick a fight with me. Where they are going to end up losing every single time. All right then, here we are, at the Harlem Center. Where are you, big guy? Time for your daily beating. Courtesy of Spider-Man. Pick on someone your own size, Rhino. There is no one my size, folk. Just talk it out. Bring it on, big guy. Oh, gotcha. Let's see if I can still hit Tim. Oh, crap. Okay, so throwing barrels at him does nothing. Looks like I'm going to have to drop heavy objects on him. His head can take it. OK, 
Okay then. I think one more round of uh, beatings would do the trick. Come on, Rhino. Oh, gotcha. All right then. <laughs> oh, it's payback time, you jackass. I'm still quite surprised that their partnership is still going out right now. And that Rhino hasn't murdered Scorpion yet. Where are you, Scorpion? Payback time for what you did to me. Once you've done your daily round of combat with Scorpion, avoid, oh, dodge him, get back up in the air, find out where he's going to, shoot your webs at him, and just beat the living crap out of him. I think one more round should do it. Honestly, I much prefer facing Rhino than Scorpion. Okay, one down, one to go. I'm over here, Rhino. Oh boy. Move it. I gotta move. Need something heavy to hit him with. Oh boy, webs are not doing anything. That was close. Gotta move. Oh, he's out of range. Yep, he was out of range. Oh, I got lucky with that one. Yeah, I rather... Oh, crap, not again. But I'd rather not repeat history with that. Oh, he's thrown. Didn't I hear you took a poetry class in the raft? Really? Rhino yeah. took a poetry class in the raft. That is not like the big guy at all. No, a tiny bit dark, but I'm impressed. Nice one, Rhino. Oh, wrong one. And that takes care of that. Time to beat him up. Let's see if this does the trick. All right, then. That's both them taken care of. What Octavius will do if he finds out you failed? I failed? Yes, you freak show! A little force together time might help you boys learn to play nice. So, four down, now on to the, the strongest two of the six. Mr. Negative and Dr. Octopus. But I want to give everybody another question. Who do you think would win in a fight? If they were at full strength, Rhino or Scorpion? And if, any, if everybody's wondering what my vote would be, my vote would go for the big guy, Rhino. Where else can we... Oh, crap. I think I know the only other place we can look. In his penthouse. That's going to be really fun. I might be able to get in undetected. I can sneak in, find the lab's location, and get out. If anything goes wrong... But I can find out what other secrets Norman is hiding in his penthouse. Wait for me to get nearby, then make your move. Okay then, ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to be ending this, ending this episode here. I do hope you all enjoyed this video, so next time when I pick this up again, it's going to be sneaking into Norman Osborne's penthouse as Mary Jane. So until next time, everybody, I do hope you all enjoyed this video. I've been Shadowstar, or Marksman72 for my PlayStation ID. Stay safe out there, take care, and I will see you all in the next video. Bye-bye.